Hey, definitely change it around. We've been to this Goodwill before, but it's been a minute. So we're just gonna check out three sections and get out of here. The sneakers, and then we're gonna check out the appliances and see what else we can come across. If there's anything worthwhile, I'll definitely let you guys know. Um, these are like women's shoes over here. I mean, there is money in women's shoes, but there's a particular type of shoes that I'm looking for. If I don't see that, then I'm letting it go. Brooks for $11, those are pretty cool. We got these Air, these Nike Sierra $14.99, nothing really there. Uh, Zara's, some Air Force Ones, are these real? $9.99? What would you guys do with this? $10? Are these real? Let me look these. The insoles is crazy dirty. I don't know. Now I'm finding these, right? But look at what they got them for on eBay. What the hell? What is going on? Let's see what things are sold for. Let's just... I mean, these are $9.99. I might have to take a, ch a chance on this. $9.99? Are you out of your mind? 24 have sold. Oh, bro. Look at that. Definitely what I'm going with right here. Let's go ahead and check out the next one. Let's go ahead and check out the next one and see what's up. The only thing that makes me iffy is I feel like the laces might have been swiped out because every picture has white laces and not black laces. So... That makes me question it a little bit, but I think that's just the lace option. You know what I'm saying? Um, yeah, man, that's crazy. $9.99 for that, $10. That's something you could take a chance on for $10, right? I think I can clean these up. We're going to rock with these for $10, bro. Like I said, they had a good amount of stuff here. They had some things that were kind of worth looking at, but I didn't want to take a chance on them. You know what I'm saying? I, I don't even want to do this, but I do at the same time. It seems like it's good, so we're gonna rock with that and see what's up. I got some elements over here for $44 or $14, excuse me. But we're leaving that alone. Some cleats, brooks, saconies or saconies, however you you know pronounce that. So we're gonna get out of here. Wait in this line right here and see what it is. I'm sure they got some good stuff there, but I'm good. I'm not looking into the clothes right now. So we got this line right here. So I'm out here at the trifecta. Damn. Damn. Never mind. So we're going to go over to Shoe Palace and see if we can find some retail arbitrage there. There used to be a Wii shop over there, but it's closed. And then we got a Goodwill like across the street over there too. So damn, it sucks that that Wii shop is closed though. Western and 18th Street. If you know the area, you know the area. So we're gonna go inside here and see if there's anything popping. They do got raffles going on in here too. So now we're back at this Goodwill. Haven't been here in a minute, but we definitely found some heat here before, especially when it comes to shoes. So we're gonna dive in the shoe section and uh, get out of here, you know? Hopefully we find something in here. They definitely switched this around too. Definitely a lot since the last time I've been here. Cleats over there, nothing worthwhile. I'm very picky now on the things I pick up. You know? We got some boots right here. These boots are cool. Also, kind of worn down. And they want how much for these? $19? Whoa. If you know me, you guys already know I'm a sucker for these. $34 for a size 15. $34 for a size 15 for these Kyrie's, bro. $34 for a size 15. Oh, let's hold on to these and see what we're gonna do with them. You guys know I'm sweating like crazy now because I found something that I do like. It is a size 15, $34. It's kind of what they're doing in the stores for them. I don't know. We'll hold on to these to see what we're going to do. Stick around to the end of the video to see what's up. But more than likely, I think I'm going to keep them. But I do have to do some research. 
Here we found some more, some free runs for the ladies, some 4.0s, but they want $19 for them. Too rich for my blood. Then we find these Air Max 90s right here too, in a grade school size, but look at how much they're beat up. So we're gonna leave those two. These right here though, size 15, you guys see the outsole. I just don't like paying $34 for them, but I think I can get like 120 to maybe 150. Let me look these up and see. Let me know what you guys would do in this particular situation. When I look them up, you know what I'm saying, they're not doing the best. One of them brand new, but pre-owns. This is what they're doing with the pre-owns, you know what I'm saying? So that's what makes me want to leave it. But then I got a couple other platforms that I can go with. You know, you got GOAT. So, so looking up here, neither for new, a size 15, 118. And there's no telling when this can happen. Is there any use listed? No use have been listed yet. I'm still gonna hold this on till I leave the store because this colorway is fire. And if it was a size 13, I would scoop it for myself, but it's not. The store is a pretty cool location. We're gonna go to the back and check out the electronics and see what we can find. Got those, we found these over here too, in the cut. I feel like somebody was trying to hide these. They only want $20 for these, $19.99. What do you guys think about these? I feel like that's a better price point than those and probably somebody did leave them over here to hide it. Let's see, memory album kit, $9.99. Purple label, let's go ahead and see what this is when we scan it with our phone. It does pop up, but no ranking and it's only going for $17.99. Nobody has it with 33. Let's go ahead and keep it and see what happens there. So, like the last time I was here, I found some dope Kobe's this time. We find some dope Kyrie's now. Like I said, size 15, so I can't fit them. But $34, I can get at least 120 to 130 for them. Size 15, and this colorway is dope. And it's not really easy to find. What do you guys think? Of course, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. That's where we're in line right now to pay. They do got some items behind there, but nothing that's really worth it for me. Nike, some Adidas shell toes. Nothing too crazy though. I wonder why they had those Adidas there, maybe. I don't know. Yeah, they're nothing special, but they're asking $59 for them shits. Maybe because they're like new. That's not gonna work though. I'm almost iffy about doing this, but uh, I know Kyrie's. Look at the outsoles. Once I clean them, only thing is this little back part right there. A little, little on the back part, but for $34, we're in there. So we're in there, look at this. 25% off purple, 50% off green. I don't know, that's the same thing. I don't see no sign for the shoes, shit. So yeah, we got some things here. I'm back on the clearance wall. We got some champion slides, $13.99. This colorway, this tie-dye is crazy. It is a size six. So I don't, know, I don't know if it'll come up, but you see they got Jordan slides there too. Let me scan this to see what happens. So they do come up. Ranking is not bad. $19.99 is what they're going for though. But of course you got higher biddings up there. Colorway is crazy though. I just don't like that it's $19 right now. I do feel like it will go up. Let me keep with this real quick. See what happens when I pop up here. $20 is what they're going for average with the FBA. I mean, we're about to get in the summertime. It did go up over 35, but recently they sold down here for about 19, 15 sales rank. Last thing we'll check is offers. I might not even keep this part in the video. This will be for members only. Members will get a chance to see stuff like this. 264 in stock. Zappos uh, has 250 and once they're done, it's open season on this thing. $13, man, what would you guys do? I like this colorway, man. This wall does have some other stuff here, just depending on uh, what type of stuff you're looking for, but they do have some, some pretty good shoes down here. I did see some T-Max also in some other colorways. In the black and gold colorway. Um, damn, I came this far down, didn't even realize it. I was trying to cover all my bases, you feel me? But they do got some new balances right there. They got those NBA GM Chuck Taylors. Um, slide on down some more. So they got these T-Max right here, the USA colorway. Those are only 59 bucks. So those are on sale for half. 
59 bucks for these black ones, which are right here, which I thought were pretty dope. Don't see these too much around, $59 as opposed to $129. That's pretty clean right there. You know what I'm saying? So, pretty good selection of some things back here on this back wall. Got those for 74. It really just depends on your style and what you're looking for. So we found a lot of good options. 13 for these. But you can't go wrong with that $9. So we're gonna go ahead and scoop up a bunch of the $9 ones. And if those other ones go down, or we'll come back and get some more of them later. I just bought some that were $9 and $14.99 of these. You know what I'm saying? I just did. So a little cheap here. I don't know, I'm gonna leave it alone. But we're taking one, two, three. Maybe, maybe those blue ones also. And then we're gonna wrap up some more. Get some more of these. Boom. Oh. That's all gonna pan out for this summer. Spring and summertime for sure. So we've had a pretty good day so far. All retail arbitrage stuff. These things will go well, especially at this time of year. As you guys can see, we've been a little busy today. Let me go ahead and slide this on in there. I love retail arbitrage days like this though. They don't happen all the time, but you gotta take advantage of it when it does. Handle with care, handle with care, handle with care. You know what I'm saying? Don't just throw shit anywhere because you're trying to hurry up. You gotta still handle with care. We need these things to be in pristine shape when we're trying to sell them. It's a pretty good day so far, you know what I mean? 